mechanics and robotics. Come join me to our robotics lab. This is the industrial collaborative robot that we introduced to the student. The student learned to how to program the robot to perform a specific task. Initially, we have programmed the, pro the robot to move the workpiece from talent A to talent B. Well done, guess what is next? First, let's look at the component on the conveyor. We have conveyor in, conveyor locate, conveyor end, the stopper, and the LED light. Before we operate the conveyor, I need to teach you the input-output testing. In short, we call it I-O testing. This is to test whether the component is correctly connected to the program. Miss Lin, how do we do that? For that, I will need your help. What is the color of this button? Great. Yes, now I need you to put a workpiece in between the conveyor in sensor. Oh, the button is blue. This shows that the conveyor in sensor is correctly connected and configured. Now, Shai Ran, it's your turn to test the other two sensors. Conveyor locate sensor part. But how should I test the conveyor end sensor? For conveyor end sensor, you can activate the sensor by pressing the white roller. Conveyor and sensor part. Good! Now I'll let Mr. Kenneth show you the next task. Kenneth! Hi, I'm Kenneth. What I want to do now is to take this pallet and place it on the conveyor belt. Move it to the middle of the belt and let the robot take the work piece. Place it on the pallet. After that, we should move the pallet to the end of the conveyor belt and turn on the amber light. Got it? Yes! yes. Good job, the requirements are met. Join us at IT College West for 9 Mechatronics and Robotics. See you soon!